Right now, looking at a policeman, I'm scared of them more than I'm scared of a thief barging into my house. This gist not only for Twitter, I see them. I see them for Twitter, for Instagram, I read them for newspaper. If they talk, say it will happen to me, I go talk, say ah, it will happen to me now. Hi, my name is Shay Mint. I'm an actor and also a talent road manager under a company called Talent View. My name now is Awofala Adirin Sola. I'm a professional chef and I own a restaurant in Lagos, Purple Bistro. Uh, for October 4th, SARS harassed me and they collect 150k from my hand. I've been in a calm restaurant. Actually, I was a few minutes away from the restaurant. Then I see the men in black, so they follow me, like say I be thief. So, I stopped, then they dragged me out of the car, saying why are they wrong for them. And everybody, they run for SARS. Even if you are a criminal or you're not a criminal, they collect my car, carry me, enter their own Sienna. The Sienna don't even get plate number. First thing they do now, my phone they collect. After they collect my phone, nothing they incriminating for the job. That's why they ask me, say, where I see money, buy moto. I show them my ID card. They talk, say, they don't get anything to do with that. So they call tell me, say, they don't go fee, release me if I don't tell them where I see money, buy a car. I see they explain, give them, say, I get to restaurants and I feel carry them go there. I show them my ID card. They don't still believe me. So they talk, say, if I don't cooperate, they feel plant something inside the car. I mean, I don't want any issue where they say go make me go sell, and I know as Nigeria be. Four FT policemen jump off the bus, and they cornered me, and they said, "Oh, sorry, can we talk to you? Um, we want to know where you work, and um, do you have an ID card?" I told them my name, and I gave them oh, the name of my company. So as I was about picking out my complimentary card from my wallet, the next thing from behind someone said, "The reason why we've been following you say." We want, we want to know if you are gay. And I, at first I was confused. I took a second and then the next thing was a slap. And then the next thing they started beating me, calling me names, despicable names, homosexual, gay, fag. There was nothing in the world that I wasn't called. According to the policemen, they said my offense was I look like a woman. I was on the floor for about 10 minutes and nobody, nobody came to my aid. In fact, after that, after the attack, some thugs wanted to pull down my pants to see if, if truly I had a male reproductive organ. After the incident, they tell me, say, I'll be better person, say, I'll be sure boy. <laughs> After they don't collect 150k for my hands. 